at um, Magders uh, on the corner of uh, Regent and Queen, and that's where I got my dresses and shoes. Um, there was uh, Mahalan's dry goods store if you wanted any materials or yard goods for sewing, and that was we we sewed a lot in those days. I don't know why. I don't know whether we were um, you know a little uh, peculiar that we made a lot of clothes. But um, that's where we got our materials, and um, that's where you went for your sheets and pillowcases. Uh, the Niagara Home Bakery, we bought our bread there. We got our ice cream there. They actually scooped ice cream out into cardboard containers. Ice cream cones were five cents. I remember my grandmother saying, would you get us some ice cream cones? I'd run up and come home with three ice cream cones <laughs> dripping. But... Uh, yeah, let's see, on grocery stores, we had lots of grocery stores. So I think we shopped mainly at McClellan's. Um, it was the closest one to us, but I do remember Marino's Fruit. Uh, he had, it was, he was a, an Italian, obviously, and all the fruit was out front, so it was very European looking, so it was uh, quite different for us. And then, oh, Fields Drug Store. I, I can still smell that. It was just wonderful. You'd, all the yardlies uh, and powders and everything was all on tables, all down the middle. And you'd walk in and, and it's just, it, it was wonderful. The fragrance coming from uh, Fields Drug Store. And that's, that's where we went. Then there was Bates Drug Store too. Um, closer, that's where we went for bubble gum and things like that that you wouldn't find at the apothecary because that was sort of more reserved for those Christmas presents and soaps and fine things that you'd give your grandmother. And then there's a five and ten cent store. We had, we had a five and ten cents that you probably call the dollar store now, but it was a large, very large store. Uh, my grandfather had a business in town in the W.H. Harrison and Sons and uh, the three boys, Alan, Jack and Don, uh, were in business with him and the hardware store was uh, where the old post, where the new post office is now. And we used to be able to go downtown and shop for everything so now we we'll pretty well have to go to St. Catharines or the big stores and um, yeah, there was a time where you could buy your clothes and your shoes and uh, your groceries.